Okay folks, welcome to another one with Sun, Sun and Sea Adventures. It's your boy here, Fairs, and we're heading on our fishing mission. Now pick up, man like D'Angelo. D'Angelo, what's your plan for today, boy? A whole lot of big reds, boy. So the man here is a whole lot of big redfish to carry home. So yeah. So guys, on this mission, we're heading out to the Gulf of Paria to do some fishing. And we'll be entering into the Gulf through the famous Carney Swamp. The Carony Swamp is the second largest wetland in Trinidad and Tobago, comprising 5.6 thousand hectares of mangrove forest. The wetland provides a variety of habitat for plants and animals, and as such supports a rich biodiversity. This area is famous for the bird sanctuary, which is home for over 1,000 species of birds, including the national bird of Trinidad and Tobago the Scarlet Ibis. If you ever visit Trinidad and Tobago, I highly recommend you book a tour to the Carney Swamp. Okay folks, so stay tuned and I hope you all enjoy this one. Peace out.
you folks, we now reach on the map. Time to get blind to the water. Check out the scene. Lovely weather, lovely skies. And colors now. Ready on their lines. So bait was extremely scarce. However, we were able to get a couple mullet and jack mackerel, which is the first time I'll be using this for bait. So you can hear the wind picking up. So that is common around this time of the year. So we'll expect the water to get rough very soon. Check it out, it's first fish. I feel second fish. First fish on camera. Them red fish in the deep eating that, you know. That would have feed on, you know. Yeah, red fish. Yeah. Eat mutton on them. This fella here, excited for you fish.
getting at it. I need a front. Check it out, folks. Why do we talk about? Woo! First red zone, boy. Big red. So guys, mostly small croaker was biting, so I decided to set out this running line again with the intention to catch another redfish. little ground here which was safely released
Ну, блин. Я пойду, пойду. Drink our Lucas areas. So I'll fight the last thing we was, right? This river is called Blue River and is known to have massive tarpons, poopers, kubera snappers, big scale salmon and catfish. So we now reach inside the swamp and we see plenty of boats around so that's a good sign it probably means that fish biting. We're now going to tie up. Swamp and I'm gonna try some lures and set up the small rod for the mango snappers or the cabrera snappers. Finally, I can set up in front of the boat.
Speedway. No again, we saw it. If I park it. I'll take my time and play. So after fishing a while with Luz, we got no hookup. We did see one huge top one jump. Nevertheless, we didn't get any bite. So it's time to try another technique. Check it out there, folks. Live catfish. So we saw the boat next to us just hook up on one massive fish. So we decided to take a drive up and check them out. We hear Gupa soup sharing in this place. I hear Gupa done clean and cook already. Yeah, we see that. And then he catches the camel just now. And one guy from me just now. I saw that. Yeah, middle of him, Gabby. I know. I want to see this monster, Gupas. That's a good thing. Allah will bless you for that. If I'm not saying, bring him nothing for him. Who's that? Well, you try to call me after this morning. Look at me, it's selling the mouth. And I am. <laughs> this from inside. Eh? I know that. That you are. Check out all these fellas. Get, check the size of this thing. Yeah. And I know like one next one. Probably about a... Yeah, a 20 pounds. No, no, no. You're not too much. Ah. <laughs> Brian, try to hard there. No, try, Oh, oh, that monster, Two. Two in me well. About 10 pounds size. Check out Captain Loggy on the balloon. Where's the contact number there? 328-5699. Word.
Indeed, a tough day of fishing. Nevertheless, still have some fish to show for it. These are red fish. Are unusual. Trigger fish. Which I understand is a good eating fish. And this is the catch of the day. Lovely lane snapper. Big up to Captain Abdul Rahim for this trip. Okay folks, so that wraps it up for this video. It was indeed a tough day of fishing. Nevertheless, we still enjoy ourselves. We have a few fish to show for it. And I guess the main excitement for me was passing through the Karani Swamp and seeing the whole vibes, the whole atmosphere within the swamp. If you've never been to the Karani Swamp or the Bird Sanctuary, I think it's something you need to do. Check out the amount of visitors actually now headed into the Bird Sanctuary.